The NCAA tournament gets underway this weekend and we've got three teams from the state represented. On the women's side, both area teams are playing each other. Iowa State got an 11 seed and will host Drake at Ames High School at 2 p.m. on Friday. The winner of that plays again on Saturday against the winner of LSU and Wisconsin. And here was the scene at Drake when they found out that they were staying in state. Both Drake and ISU are excited for the opportunity. This is the second time in like 20 or so, so years that the women's team has made NCAAs. So we're definitely really excited and proud of this team and what we've done. I mean, what an in-state rival. We played them earlier this year and I know this will be a battle. Drake will come ready. Uh, they're a well-coached team by Brianna Addison. They just won their conference. So uh, we absolutely need to be, be prepared as we uh, go into Friday's match and uh, excited to get out there. ISU and Drake played back on January 14th and the Cyclones won. 7 nothing. The other team from the state, the Drake men, the Bulldogs, won the Summit League and will play their first round match against number 16 North Carolina. That's set for 2 Eastern on Friday in Chapel Hill. And this was the scene shortly after the women's announcement for the men. Drake won the Summit League. Oh, yeah. The Bulldogs are making their 14th appearance in the NCAA tournament and the community loves it. Having the name come up, you have the support, uh, we, we've got incredible community engagement and just giving them something again to kind of be a part of and share with us and for us to share with them. When they say Drake and you get the claps and you get the smiles, you get the high fives, man, it, it's, uh, you know what they say, Des Moines home team. And uh, we've been kind of pushing that and playing on that and this is Des Moines home team. Get all of your NCAA tournament highlights right here at Local 5 this weekend.